After a rocky start to the season, the South Walton baseball team has turned it on when it matters most. The Seahawks riding a seven game win streak heading to the class 4A region semifinals in mid April. The Hawks were just one game above 500 battered and bruised from facing the toughest strength of schedule out of any team in their classification. Fast forward to the present, they look nearly unbeatable, dominating Arnold 7 to 1 for the district title and run ruling West Florida in the opening round of the playoffs. Head coach Nick Borthwick says his young but experienced team is playing its best baseball of the season, but more importantly, they're having a lot of fun. Our guys play with a passion and enthusiasm that's uh, contagious, and they, they want to play at that high level every time we step on the field. So you got to create energy, and that's what they're good at. We want them to continue to be sportsmanlike, but, it, but have fun and, and play at a high level. So uh, we've embraced that role. I've actually moved to the dugout as well. I've moved off third base to try to keep the energy up in the dugout. Seahawks are facing a familiar foe in the region semifinals, two seed Bishop Kenny, who's not come out of the playoffs in back to back seasons. Revenge is the goal, and Coach Borthwick says his team is well prepared. That's the reason we set up that schedule is to have the strength to schedule to, to face teams similar to that. So when you get in that environment, you know it's just another game. So uh, our boys are prepared. I told them yesterday, nobody's as prepared as we are to play our best at this time. So um, we're excited to go to Jacksonville Saturday night. We're going to be playing our best baseball. South Walton departed for Jacksonville this afternoon to give them a night to rest before taking on the Crusaders tomorrow evening. First pitch from Bishop Kinney High School is set for 7 p.m. Eastern time.